Steve, good evening. We're in the center concourse at Jordan Creek. You can see there are shoppers all around us here, but Black Friday has really taken on a new identity in recent years. No doubt Black Friday is still big. Big for retailers, big for shoppers who are willing to stand in lines for their turn to check out the deals. And signs in the mall still hype the bargains. Lalo Ochoa's family started shopping before sunrise in eastern Iowa. By midday, he needed a breather. I'm having actually a pretty good time right now. I got stuck with bag control over here and I decided, to just, I decided to just sit down and relax for a few minutes. But the pace of Black Friday has slowed down in recent years and has broken from the trend of going all night. Back in 2007, we did uh, Rock and Shop and Eve, where we opened the mall at midnight um, on Thanksgiving or 1201 the day after Thanksgiving, however you want to look at it. And the lines were crazy. It was something unique. It hadn't been done very often. And for a while after that, malls started opening on Thanksgiving. But general manager Randy Tennyson says attitudes about that have shifted. I think people are just kind of get, got a little bit tired of being open on Thanksgiving. Just wanted to have a little bit more time with their families, especially the workers. Also, many of the Black Friday deals that attract shoppers actually start a week early and continue through Friday. There's a lot of just special things and discounts and it's just easier to shop, more fun. So malls still are busy, but a little less frantic. Some shoppers say they actually prefer the rush of the old days. We loved getting up early and coming to the mall, but now everything's online. Now the busiest shopping days of the season are the weekend before Christmas. We're live at Jordan Creek. Andrew Mullenbeck, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.